It's Thursday, and guess what this must be? I've been waiting for this since January. January, and I really hope it's not broken, because this package worries me. even fancier in person. Why is it rattling? It's making me nervous. Um, <laughs> it's even fancier than I thought it was going to be. For some reason I thought it was just going to be regular, like the Mighty Boosh. But instead it's like last season's was. So I can take them off and make them do inappropriate things when they're not attached to the DVD. Not that I did that before or anything, but I'm excited, especially about outtakes. Friggin' yeah. They call me the Amazon priest. I deliver your DVDs to you in a holy way. Jesus Christ, what are you doing? I guess it's not good for a priest to say Jesus Christ. Sorry. So, anyway, apart from this, um, today is a very special day for a very special friend of mine, it's Miss Stephanie Mondo Retro. Um, she just married her boyfriend, Chris. So he's her husband, Chris, now. So I have to say congratulations to the both of them, and I hope they have the most wonderful, beautiful of lives together. Lives. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure they will, so. But yeah, I'm thinking of them. And I'm wearing the necklace that Mondo made me. And this cat looks just like Gertie. So Gertie's cousin is wishing them the best. She says hi. She puts up with all sorts of stuff. But yeah, congratulations, and there's a tear in my eye right now, so <laughs> I'm so happy for you guys. So since I got the DVD, I have not been able to like take it off my lap. I like to look down and see them in my lap. But anyway, going off of Vlogist's theme now, um, today I'm going to talk about Billy Boyd, who is not from England, but he's from Britain, a part of Britain known as Scotland. So when I was a freshman in college, I became really, really obsessed with Lord of the Rings. I got the books and read them for the first time, and then I got all of the movies. I was in love with Pippin ever since the first time I read them. So, and it kind of, it got me through freshman year because I was so shy and nervous because it was my first time away from home, like for a very, very extended period. And I didn't really get along with my roommates that well at first. We got we got along better later. But um, at first I was just so shy and so out of place. And so Lord of the Rings helped me relax. It was something I could do to relax. And so I just, I fell in love with Billy Boyd and Pippin. So, and then I went to a convention. I think it was the last official Lord of the Rings convention that summer. Elf in um, New Jersey, Secaucus. Um, which is fun to say. And I met Billy Boyd. We hugged. And he gave me an autograph and all that, and then I posed with him for a group shot later. And then I had, I won a sign, an autographed poster for his charity that he had signed from a previous convention. I won that on eBay. While I was still at school, I had written one of those um, addressed envelopes that you send to the celebrity and try to get their autograph. And I think I had put a little letter in there too. So, but this was all three years ago. And then, just the other day, I go to my parents' house, and this is waiting for me. Three years ago, man, and he gave me an autograph. So now I have three Billy Boyd autographs, but this is the only one that has my name on it. Because at the convention, they couldn't sign your name, and the poster could have gone to anybody. But this is the first time he's written my name, and so for that, I'm going to really, really treasure this little picture. I'm going to have to put it in a frame. But that was pretty awesome. So he's an awesome Brit. And so my, my, my heart will always have a little space for Billy Boyd, the little Scott. Look at what Cashy did to it. Look at all those tooth holes. Ow. <laughs> it was worth it. I definitely think I just lost some skin. Until Sunday, this is Thursday!